Hey guys! Alright guys, we're here to do the second video on this Monday doubleheader. This is a Patreon request from this Patreon right here. Ask us to check out Engen State or Engen State, Eng State I Zero. I can't read that. I'm gonna go with Eng State Zero. The name of the song is Fringe. Uh, so it, that that is an easy one. Yeah, Zero and Fringe were the only two I could read, but... When I think of Fringe, I think of the Lunatic Fringe. Remember Dean Ambrose? Oh. Yeah, he's not Dean Ambrose anymore. He changed his name when he went to uh, AEW. Yeah. I don't know, what, what, what do they call him now? John Moxley? Yeah, yeah. John Moxley. How the fuck do you go from Dean Ambrose to John Moxley? I mean, uh, it's not remotely similar. Well, uh, apparently that was his name before, and then he had to change oh, it. Oh, that was his name before he went to WWE? Yeah. And then when he went to WWE, they, they, call they, him, they said they call him Dean Ambrose. Yeah. I, I, anyways. Anyways. I'm not even going to try to rationalize that. Uh, are you ready for this? By the way, I think this is a death metal band because on the video it says death metal. Yeah. It would be quite the oddity if it turns out to be folk metal. Yeah. So, uh, or power I, I, metal. Yeah, I think this is going to be death metal. So are you ready for this? Yeah. Alright, let's do it.
I'm not sure where where to start with this. Do I start with a song or do I start with this Japanese sci-fi movie? I, I, I don't I don't I don't think this was shot just for the music video. I think they took this from an actual yeah. sci-fi movie. I wonder what that movie was. I mean, it must have been really old because this the special effects. The only thing that came to my mind was Flash Gordon from back in the day. Japanese Flash Gordon. It was like a Japanese Flash Gordon. Yeah, it was. I was gonna say something, but I, was, <laughs> I better not say it. Ah, oh, Sayonara Flash Gordon. <laughs> <laughs> we send uh, Godzilla. It's Flash Gordon, but the main character is Trisha Takanawa. Yeah, it's Trisha Takanawa. I mean, Trisha Takanawa. I think she's Korean, isn't she? I always thought she was Korean for she, some reason. She never really says her, her... We don't know what her background is. She kind of just says she's Asian reporter. Yeah, she's Asian reporter Trisha Dakana, which leaves it kind of open. I think she is Japanese, though. You think she's Japanese? I for think... some reason, I thought she was Korean. For some reason... I, I don't know why I thought that. I swear but... there was an episode that uh, Peter would call her his uh, Japanese tiger mama. Or really? The, yeah. Where she was going to marry Somehow uh, I'm not Carter. Saying... She was going to marry She Carter. was going to get married with Carter? Yeah. Wow. But that was all just because uh, she did it for a report to get him to confess about something. Oh, about something. Oh, she was like uh, undercover. Undercover, Investigative yeah. reporter. Yeah. Oh, wow. Anyways, what, what did you think of the song? I actually the... wanted to know what you thought. About the song? About the song, yeah. All right. <clears throat> uh, before before this, I say something about the song, let me just say, when the video started and I see this bearded man running, I thought that was a galactic criminal. I was like, what the fuck? Does Galactic Criminal have a death metal band? And he never told me anything about it? It totally looks like Galactic Criminal. I was like, wow, Galactic Criminal in a music video. Then once I got over that, I was, then I got like sidetracked with the whole Japanese sci-fi thing. I'm like, Flash Gordon uh, meets Godzilla. That's all was missing there. But anyways, I was like, wow, this with almost, you can almost see the strings when the, when the rocket yeah, ship is. Yeah. Anyways, moving on to the, um, I'm, I'm, I'm drooling. Uh, moving on to the, <laughs> to the tra that's what this video has done to me. I mean, seriously, this song in this video, uh, going into the song, I, I don't know, man, this, there's some things I like about the track and there's some things I don't like about the track. So See, I'm kind of like in the middle. I'm kind of pregnant about this song. That's what I was going to say. I just want to know what you were thinking. Um, because I was enjoying myself at certain points and I would look at you and you didn't look like you were enjoying yourself. I'm like, I felt the song was very dissonant at times. Like it's just some, see, for me, um, at the start of the song, it felt like one part of the guitars were really, really fast and one part was just kind of slow. So it, it was like they were slowly drifting away from each other. But after a while, I kind of grew to like it a little bit. Throughout the song, the guitars for me, I really, really liked the guitars. To me, I felt the guitars were too driven. <sighs> the sound was so penetrating. It was like I know almost something out of, out of, like out of a of old school black metal album, which, which but, I don't mind it in that setting. Right, but, this but, is I, not, but not in necessarily in for I this song. The f I, I wanted the the vocals have so much volume in them, and I wanted the sound of the guitars to have that same kind of volume. This to me would have worked better it, instead of of the song being a hundred miles an hour. If the song was a little bit more chuggier, if it moved a little bit slower, yeah. more dragging. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. To me, I felt like the the the. Almost like the vocals didn't match what was happening with with the sound. Some not all the time, but at, at certain, in certain, at certain points. See, the, for me, like, that's certain, what I'm saying was very for dissonant. Me, for me, certain points of the guitars and uh, and the whole sound would either pick up, and that's when I didn't like it as much. But when it went back to the the way it started and like that kind of formula where it was a little bit fast and then had that chugginess to it too, I really really liked that. So I think out of the song, if I was gonna put it into percentage, I, I liked like seventy percent of this song. But then there was certain parts that really dropped me out and then picked me back up like after. Yeah, it, it, I'm not I'm not saying that I hate the track. I'm not saying that I don't like the song. I'm just saying that to me there were certain I'm with you. There were certain I'm kind of pregnant about it, right? Yeah. There's certain things that I liked and there were certain things that I didn't like. I enjoyed but, the vocals overall. For me, to me the vocals perhaps was the most consistent thing about the yeah. song that I I can say from the beginning all the way to the end. I like the vocals. See, and also sometimes when this happens, like uh, we like certain parts of our song and then there's also stuff that we don't like. Usually there's more things that we don't like about the song, so we just say we don't like it. For This, this one's one, actually more that I like than I don't uh, like. Yeah, the, for this one, I actually like a lot of it uh, and I don't like just small things here and there. But to me, s certain parts, they threw me for a loop. Yeah. Like it just confused me. And, and that's why I'm saying the song was very dissonant. Like it, 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 it just didn't have the red line. No, it, it was hard for me 
similar to the movie because the movie was not it was like clips right yeah so similar to it was hard for me to keep track w with what was happening in the movie the same thing was ha was i'm having i was having a hard time staying connected with the song all the way through understanding where i am where we're going and how are we gonna get there that was hard for me to kind of wrap my head around but overall i, I can't say that i hate it I, I perhaps i would have to listen to it a few more times yeah. but like I said, it's it's. I hate to say this because I always say that there's no such thing as kind of pregnant. But, but this song, I am kind of pregnant yeah. about it. You know, it is what it is. It's gonna take a couple more listens, and to be honest, it has enough in the song that I'm willing to listen go back. to it. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. All right, guys, this is it for this Monday double header. Come back tomorrow. We'll have more videos for you. See you guys. See ya.